right, yo, what is up everybody? I am back here for another video. And today guys, I have my updated gaming setup for all of you guys. I told you guys last time my desk was coming in and I have a new gaming setup for you. So here it is. Obviously guys, this desk setup is a lot different than my old one. And I like it a lot better. This desk just came in yesterday and obviously the cable management isn't great. I'm gonna figure out a way to make it a little bit better, but I, I, it, it's not horrible for now. But yeah, this desk came in yesterday and it took me and Andrew um, two hours to put this whole desk together. So it was it was a pain and I couldn't be more happy with it. So it was definitely worth the time. And also it was worth the money because this was only $120. Now if ignore that drill over there, this is the same chair that I had in my last setup. I'm probably gonna get a new one, but it doesn't really matter. And I now have a 40 inch TV, as you guys can see me right here. I now have a 40 inch TV instead of my 65 inch TV like I had in my old setup. But I don't know, it doesn't really bother me. I don't watch TV a lot anyway. But yeah, I had to get the 40 inch TV because my 65 inch TV would not fit right here. And it would also look really weird with this desk setup. It was just, it would have been weird. So I just got a smaller TV, put it there. And actually the TV is the only side or the only thing on this side of the desk besides like my TV remote and then my change jar and then a candle back there. That's the only thing on this side of the desk, which if you guys have any, you know, better ideas, let me know because I think that it's very plain and boring and I really don't like it that much. But moving on, you know, we got the same plant that was in my last setup. I love having fake plants in my room. I really do. My speaker and then my controllers, which looks great. Uh, I just, I don't know. I don't know what else to do with this corner. So if you guys have any ideas, let me know. You have my Apple watch right here that's charging and then another charger. It's a USB-C just in case, you know, like I need to charge anything that takes a USB-C. A light back there under the shelf, which I think looks very cool right there. My notebook, in case I want to write down any like YouTube ideas or write down anything that I need to write down. A pencil right beside of it and then my phone stand and then obviously my ps5 which is the staple of this setup because you know it is a ps5 setup and i might get the black side panels because i know they sell them now and i might get that but moving on from my ps5 you know my light remote my keyboard which i don't really use that keyboard i just don't feel like getting rid of it so it's just sitting there i think it I think it adds a little something just so it's not super plain. And then that remote right there is for that light up underneath there. And then my 25 inch monitor, which is the same monitor I had last time. I haven't really gotten anything new specifically for the setup besides the desk. I just rearranged everything. And then my pegboard up there is the exact same. It's just now not aligned with my desk and it bugs me. I might move it over or I might put a poster right there and then another one right here. I don't really know what I'm gonna do with my walls yet. That's the one thing that I have no clue what I wanna do with. On here to my cable management, you know, you have that thing that's plugged into the wall. My This is my monitor actually. And I don't know why that's such a big power thing, but whatever. And then you have all my cords kind of like in a bread tie knotted together, just hanging there. This is all the stuff that makes my setup run. Now that power strip really doesn't have anything plugged into it, but it's fine. I'll figure out something. And cause I always need something to plug into. The ring light is the box that it came in that I haven't felt like thrown away yet. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna continue updating this setup and I'll probably just, you know, keep making more videos about it because I'm in love with my setup. But the last video did really well, so I had to do an update because, you know, maybe you guys care, maybe you don't, I don't know yet. I guess we'll find out whenever this video goes up. Anyway, if you guys want a full room tour, I'll give you that too. But my setup, it is what it is. Let me know how I can make it better. And I'll see you guys all on the next one. Take it easy, guys. Peace.